Hello dear researchers, welcome to the heaven of researcher BK School of Research. Here is Vision Kumar. I am here to show you the tips and tricks of research. Today I will show how to measure poverty through Foster Gear Thorbeck Index. Before going to the measurement, let's go for have a look the theory. The theory. You know, James Foster, Joel Greer, and Eric Thorbeck in 1984 first formulated a index, an index known as Foster Gear Thorbeck Index after the name. The formula is FGT alpha equals 1 by n and blah blah blah, where h is the total number of poor household whose income is below the poverty line, yi is the income of individual household, n is the total number of households and z is the poverty line. And the alpha has three values 0, 1 and 2. 0 means the formula gives headcount index, 1 means poverty gap and 2 means squared poverty gap. So let's go to the measurement. To measure the Forster Gear Thorbeck index, we need the two value only. The value is individual's income and poverty line. So let's go to the data file. Here is the data file. You see here is per capita income and this is poverty line and its number, number of households. And here I have written uh, uh, the steps of the formula. So I have, uh, I have a number, numerous number of households. I have one, I have nine for three number of households. So now I am going to measure, going to show how to measure Foster Gear Thorbeck Index, right? First of all, I would uh, measure the difference between poverty line and individual income. So, press enter and drag it and then this divided by poverty line and uh, drag it. Uh, now, I will take a first bracket and this value and this value I will take the power 0, right? So, I got it and drag then I will take first bracket this value bracket close and the power 1. So, press enter. I have got and drag it. Finally, the squared poverty gap. This column is showing the squared poverty gap. I will close the bracket and take the power 2 and press the enter button and drag it. So, I have got some values. Now I will select the whole document and click on data menu and click on the sort. I will make a sort with respect to Z minus Y, smallest to largest, smallest to largest. So here, here you see the first the smallest values are negative values and we, we have found some positive values as well. Uh, from, from the number of households 9 to 3, the last number of negative values and from sorry, sorry 6 for 6, the ne last negative value and then 647 started the positive value. So I will take the summation of these three numbers, these three columns. I will take the summation of these three columns and press on 
auto sum i will take press auto sum i have got the auto sum here auto sum here so i can write down its sum and here here fgt foster gear thorvik index right so foster gear thorvik index means this summation divided by total number of households as i have 943 i have 943 households 943 so i will press enter and this is the poverty head count i will now measure the poverty gap 943 and finally the squared poverty gap divided by 943 so these are the uh, poverty rate of poverty you can find out it in percentage as well so you can multiply this value by 100 so you get it in percentage similarly multiply by 100 you will get it in percentage and for the last one multiply by 100 and you will get the percentage of squared poverty gap so among the total households 31.60 percent people are poor which means lives below the poverty line 9.95 percent people show that the poverty gap and 4.85 percent poverty uh, people are su suffering from severe poverty right so let's go to the theory again we see here this formula shows measures the incidence depth and severity so the first one head count come to the data file this is the head count the incidence of poverty depth of poverty and severity of poverty so this is the foster gear thorbeck index measurement of foster gear thorbeck index we have measured this whole calculation in ms excel 2010 thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe this channel and press the bell icon like comment and share thank you